What's good, Josh? Your boy Ross back at again with another video. So we're gonna check out top 22 WWE OMG moments in 2022, man. Uh, this year has had some crazy moments when it comes to spots and highlights. So we're gonna check that out. Go down memory lane by uh with the homie uh tap out corner if you haven't already go subscribe to his channel man and i am still your undisputed u2 wrestling champ of the world man no one's taking that title from me i know you guys want to try to take the title from me but it's not happening so we're gonna check this out appreciate all the love and support you guys have shown on the channel man and let's see what 2022 has brought us when it comes to some of the OMG highlight moments, man. On this match. The timing on that RKO. Oh Beautiful. Chop from Gunther. Level. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. The, the impact. That was a beautiful spot, too. Oh my God. Let's kick off. Oh my God. Brock Lesnar F5's Austin Theory off a chamber pop. That was wild. That was. Oh! <laughs> that was insane, bro. Number 21, Liv Morgan jumps off a 15 foot structure. Morgan going extreme with a senton to the table. That was a cool spot, too. From Number Liv. 20, Cody Rhodes' torn pectoral muscle. Of course. Oh my God. That was Number brutal. 19, Santos Escobar flips Solo Sakawa off a ladder. Oh! Oh! Number 18. People have been saying that I need to watch that ladder match. I, I may actually go back and just watch that. I heard that was a pretty good ladder match from NXT. I may need to go check that out. I've seen so many clips of it. Where it just look it just looked like a train wreck. That oh that spot was ridiculous. Matt Riddle RKO's Seth Rollins off a ladder. Riddle's got Rollins. That was cool. Are you kidding? That was cool. And then we thought Riddle was gonna win. Look this at was this. amazing. An unbelievable super RKO from the top of the ladder. Oh my god. Number 17, Grayson Waller does an elbow drop through the announcer's table. Oh, I ain't gonna lie to you. That was it. The extra arm movement really does nothing. It's just for flair at the at that point, but it still looked cool as hell. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, 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 that shit was cool. Number sixteen. Hold on, we, wait, hold on, hold on. I just want to go back and see that because we got we got to give my man some 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 extra points off the style, off the style of that 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 the style points alone. Deserve some extra, extra, uh, a rewind. The Waller does an elbow drop through the announcer's table. Look at this. Oh, my God. To do tonight, go and fire. That was pretty tough. I just have to see it one more time. Number 16, Montez Ford jumps out of the ring and lands perfectly. That was... Oh, my God. <laughs> Number 15, Becky Lynch does a leg drop from the top of the cage. Was this funny, man? The man with a leg drop from way that was a cool spot. High, the man Look at that. Sacrificing herself. Number 14, the Viking Raiders powerbomb Xavier Woods through two tables. This was cool, too. Oh, my God. Number 13, Edge Spears AJ Styles midair. He's not here. Yo, Styles. I was looking for oh. I think a lot of us expected this match to be a little bit better than what it was. Not to say that it was bad. I think it I think a lot of us expected this match to steal the show. And it really didn't. It was it was okay and it got better towards the end. Um and especially started setting up stuff with the judgment day, you know, and and all that falling into place. But I think a lot of us was really expecting, oh, this is gonna be the match to steal the show. And then unfortunately didn't it was it was good though but it wasn't i think i guess maybe our expectations as fans was a little bit too high but it was still it was still a a, a solid match though the first place so understandably aj styles was distracted and that cleared the way for this mid air number 12 Ilya dragunov suplexes jordan devlin onto a pile of chairs i think i've seen this by yep oh, oh a very 
Number 11, RKO <laughs> from out of nowhere. From the heavens! Oh, the the timing on that it was nice, though. Gotta look at it again. This was unreal. The look timing on that was pretty good. Is, then the nasty impact. Number 10, Omos gets thrown through a table. Lifting the giant! Oh! <laughs> giant fly! Number nine, Matt Riddle jumps from atop the pit. This was a cool one. Oh my God, the impact. Oh my, look at, oh my God. Number eight, Nathan Frazier does a crossbody through a ladder. Frazier, what the hell is that? Number seven, Drew McIntyre suplexes Sami Zayn from the top of the cage. Oh, jeez. Number six, Logan Paul hits Roman Reigns with a frog splash. This definitely deserves to be high on the list. He had his phone in the, in his hand, and the frog he hit the frog splash with the phone in his hand, and to see the camera view was insane. Like, bro, I know he's kind of in some controversy right now, so I know a lot of people are not really uh, rocking with him. Once again, Logan Paul finds himself in some controversy, uh, but you can't deny this was a cool spot by him. Uh, he he be killing them from the top rope to the uh, announce table frog splashes. He be killing them through a table. That was such a cool look at this. Oh my god, that was insane. Number five, Kevin Owens hits a senton from the railing. That's a lot of weight. Jesus. Number four, Kofi kicks and crossbodies Sheamus through the barricade. Oh my god. Number three, Brock Lesnar flips the ring. This with is a such a OMG moment. That was such a cool moment, bro. Number two, Never Stone seen Steve before. Austin returns for one more match. Of course, this is an OMG moment. This was so great, man. This was so, this was so fun, bro. Like I, I just I returned to a kid <laughs> during night one at WrestleMania. I just turned into a kid again to see Stone Cold out there have a match. I was just like, and I know I was one of the people was like, oh, I don't want to see Stone Cold in a ring. You know, I think, you know, it's, you know, it's best to, you know, leave it where it's at. But you know what? I stand corrected, and I was glad I was able to see that. I was. I stand corrected. I am glad I was able to see that. And he, he looked good out there. It wasn't a traditional, you know, wrestling match. You know, it was more so kind of, you know, anything goes to kind of, you know, I guess, I guess, you know, saying help with him and, you know, the ring rust that he probably has gotten from not really just being in the ring like that, and especially in front of a WrestleMania crowd. But either way, it was still fun. If you're if you grew up in the Attitude Era, there's no way you can't like this, you know. If you want Stone Cold Steve Austin to compete in a match tonight against this sack of shit, oh, on it. Oh, oh, it's stumbling. Give me a hell yeah. And number one, Cody Rhodes returns. Oh, yeah. This is so good. Wrestling has more than Oh, I get goosebumps, bro. I get goosebumps, bro. That's, ah! Goosebumps, dog. That was so fucking crazy, bro. To see the best. Oh, that was such a great moment. Oh, I got goosebumps. Just, I was shaking. That was so fucking cool, bro. So fucking cool, man. Hey, man, but comment down below. Let me know what's some of y'all favorite OMG moments from this year in WWE. Let me know down below, man. What was your favorite OMG moment from this year, man? It's it, Cody Rhodes coming back. I know the, you know, there was speculations and, you know, people were saying he was coming back, but to just see it. Like, I, I think people knew, but to see it happen and the way it happened, and the reaction to it, it was such a great moment. It's, it's just all, OMG, he's really back. This is really a thing. And him and Seth Rollins had a fantastic match. WrestleMania this year was fantastic. Looking forward to next year being even better. Hopefully, Triple H can make that happen, man. But 
I am still your undisputed YouTube wrestling champ of the world. And I appreciate y'all kicking with me. See y'all on the next one. Peace.